Hi, I'm Richard Noble. And way back in 1983, I drove my car, Thrust 2, to a new world land speed record of 633 miles an hour. We moved on after that, and Andy Green drove our car, Thrust SSC, through the sound barrier to achieve the first ever supersonic land speed record. And now, we're building the Bloodhound. This car is capable of 1,000 miles an hour. Now, getting to 1,000 miles an hour requires a unique array of technologies. Bloodhound has three engines for a start. A jet engine from a Eurofighter Typhoon, a nano rocket motor for propulsion, and a 550 horsepower V8 Jaguar engine just to pump the rocket fuel. The car features very advanced materials in just about every area of construction and cutting edge computer modeling and design. And this represents the very best of British engineering and innovation. Now, Bloodhound has 135,000 horsepower, and it needs all that power because it's going to make this run over a 12-mile strip on the desert. And in the middle of the desert is the measured mile, and Bloodhound will cover it in 3.6 seconds. So what's it like traveling like this? Well, sit back, hold on tight, because you're just about to find out. Bloodhound SSC, engine start. Engine winds up, NH response, NL response. The most sophisticated land speed record car in history, Bloodhound supersonic car, with the engine now winding up, ready to go. Hydraulics are starting to come up. Power generators online, power systems are online. The EJ200 is the most advanced military jet engine in the world. And as it winds up, and the hydraulics and the electrics come online, final checks to make sure that the car is ready to go. Temperatures are nominal, coolant's good. Jaguar engine's ready to go.
I see. Safe, safe, safe. Now that, of course, was an animation. But we're going to do this for real in 2016 on the Hackskeen Pan in South Africa. Right now, the desert is being prepared. 300 people have worked for three years to clear the desert of surface stones. They've moved around 15,000 tons of stones. In the meantime, the design and build of this car is being followed by 5,700 schools in what is turning out to be one of the largest outreach programs designed to inspire the next generation of scientists and engineers. Bloodhound SSC is very proud of its long association with Coventry Transport Museum and we hope you've enjoyed the experience. Thank you.